Hello. Harumakun Channel. Harumakun's father, a former Japanese anime editor, would like to share his impressions of American films. The movie this time is Casablanca. Please watch until the end. After watching this video, please subscribe to the channel and give it a high rating. I would be very happy if you could comment again. Casablanca is an American film released in 1942, set during World War II. Even from a Japanese perspective, this film offers a great deal of excitement and emotion. Firstly, the story takes place in the city of Casablanca, Morocco, against the backdrop of the tumultuous era of World War II. At the time, Japan was also engaged in the war, and Morocco, where the film is set, was occupied by the Allied powers such as the United States and the United Kingdom. From a Japanese viewpoint, the presence of characters like Rick played by Humphrey Bogart and his cafe, Cafe American, might evoke a sense of distance or foreignness. Rick, a former officer in the Republican Army who had supported them during the Spanish Civil War, now maintains a neutral position and operates Cafe American. This neutral stance and the situation of Casablanca, where many refugees gather, stand in contrast to the militaristic influence and controlled atmosphere that Japan was experiencing at the time. While Japan was strongly driven by nationalism and under the grip of militarism, the existence of a neutral zone like Casablanca and a gathering place for refugees might offer a fresh perspective for Japanese viewers. The story unfolds as Victor Laszlo played by Paul Henry, a fugitive who escaped from the Nazis and serves as a resistance leader, appears before Rick. He possesses crucial documents sought by both the Nazis and the Allied forces, leading to a power play between them. Rick is faced with the dilemma of protecting Victor. From a Japanese perspective, witnessing Rick's inner struggle between good and evil, justice and self-interest, can resonate deeply. His selflessness and sense of justice are commendable. Furthermore, the film introduces Ilsa played by Ingrid Bergman, Rick's former lover. She reunites with Rick and seeks his help. However, she is now married to Victor, and Rick is torn between his emotions and his conscience. In the end, Rick decides to help Victor and Ilsa escape. This choice, from a Japanese viewpoint, resonates with Rick's compassionate nature and self-sacrificing spirit. He suppresses his own feelings and chooses justice and humanitarian action, demonstrating the value of human dignity and freedom. Casablanca portrays themes of love, devotion, personal sacrifice, and moral choices. Even from a Japanese perspective, it offers an opportunity to contemplate the wartime circumstances and the influence of militarism that Japan was facing at the time. Through characters like Rick, who takes a neutral position, and Victor, a resistance leader, viewers can empathize with notions of justice and freedom. Additionally, the film's depiction of human emotions and complexities strikes a chord. Particularly, the scenes of Rick and Ilsa's past relationship and their reunion evoke intense emotions, captivating the audience. Their poignant encounters and farewells are profoundly moving. The visual aesthetics of Casablanca are noteworthy as well. The black and white cinematography enhances the atmosphere of the story. The meticulous recreation of Cafe American's interior and the city's landscapes allows viewers to immerse themselves in the ambience of that era. Casablanca is a masterpiece that skillfully weaves historical background and human emotions. Even from a Japanese perspective, it offers profound inspiration through themes of war, love, justice, and freedom. The film's powerful messages and emotional storytelling leave a lasting impact on the audience. This time, I picked up Casablanca. How was it? If you don't mind, please subscribe to the channel and give it a high rating. In the Harumakuen channel, I am distributing videos of my children, Harumakuen and Momo-chan's daily life in Japan and Japanese game commentary. Please watch those videos as well. Thank you for watching until the end. See you in the next video.